Hey, what's happening, gamers? Welcome back to Streets of Rage 4 on K Wings Let's Plays. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell to be notified when more Streets of Rage arrives. And special shout outs to our members. If you guys want to join the membership crew, all you have to do is click this little join button and select the tier that works for you. So, today awesome. we're continuing the third stage in Streets of Rage, and Amber's playing as a different character. Let's go. All right, the cargo ship. I don't know how many stages there are, but Ooh. the cargo ship I remember from one of the original Streets of Rage games. It's raining. Pretty awesome. Yep. So I did some research and uh, I was looking at some of the Streets of Rage games that we have, like from that um, Sega collection. Mm -hmm. So this game actually takes place 10 years after Streets of Rage 3. So. Uh, that game came out in 1994. I believe the story takes place in 1993, so this is supposed to be 2003. Mmm, okay, cool. Yep. And, uh, Blaze originally was a police detective. She's been retired for some time, and she and Axel used to be an item. And oh, their friend, who was in the first Streets of Rage game, his name is Adam, and, uh, he is Cherry's dad. Oh, okay. But he's not here right now. No, Adam has only ever been playable in the very first Streets of Rage game, and then you played as his younger brother, Skate, who was um, probably one of my favorite characters to play as in Streets of Rage 2 because he had rollerblades. And oh, awesome. he was the fastest character in the game. Yep. Yeah, it does feel like... Like you said, like everyone was a lot younger in the other Streets of Rage. Uh-oh. Sorry! So everybody, I guess the character models are a lot bulkier in this one. Well, I mean, let's see. She is probably supposed to be early 30s now, since this is, takes place in the 2000s. And uh, that explains why the computer monitors um, look a little bit different. Although, yeah. I wanted to say this game took place in like 1998 or 99, but it's early 2000s. Okay, that's cool. Yep, and there's also two versions of Streets of Rage 3. The American version, which was censored and changed completely, and the Japanese version, which uh, alters the story and adds another playable character. Oh, wow. Yeah. We've only played the American version, and I didn't like it. So, you know that robot guy I was talking about from Streets of Rage 3? Mm -hmm. He is your character's mentor. And he was basically, he looks like a Chinese guy with, like, metal arms like Cyborg. Oh, So wow. you are his apprentice. Oh, wow, because I also have metal arms. Exactly. So you're basically, like, the Jax of uh, Streets of Rage. That works out well. But what's interesting is we're, uh, Adam's daughter <laughs> basically makes Streets of Rage, like, the, the Adam uh, family because you played as him in the first game, his brother oh. in the second and third game, and ten years later, you're playing as Adam's daughter. Oh, interesting. So, yeah. But Adam is unlockable in this game. Oh, wow. Interesting. Yep. As is all the Streets of Rage characters. So this is kind of oh, like wow. a... wow. That's awesome. Yeah. It's like a Streets of Rage highlight. Uh -huh. But it doesn't have the original games playable. So you'll need to get the uh, Sega Collection, which is on the Switch. And uh, I can show you guys what that looks like at the end of this episode, if you want to see. Like on our, um, you know, menu or whatever you want to call it. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like the expressions of the character Ooh. makes when they're fighting and stuff. And there is no way to turn off friendly fire. Uh, usually what people would do in the old game, you could actually throw each other back and forth and use your momentum to hurt people. Oh, okay. I kind of need that. And you can pick up whatever that is, so. I, I kind of see it in the corner there. See it shining? Oh! Sorry, a I didn't button. even know I could do a that. A button pick up. Oh, now I know I have a super move. There you go. Sorry. It's fine. <sighs> Oops. <laughs> I was so painful. I'm sorry. Now I know my super move is pretty awesome. Okay. Oh. Nora. Nora is a Streets of Rage staple. Nora Freeze? No, no. She's... She's supposed to be, like, the Final Fight version of Poison, except she's a girl. More or less. Oh, okay. She, uh, represents, uh... Mm, I don't know how to explain this, but she is a red light district person. Okay. Who works for the bad guys. Ice. So, in this game, she is a crime lord. One of the people that owns, 
I guess the city has been divided up by uh, a bunch of bad guys. Yeah. Because Mr. X is finally gone, who was the big bad of the original Streets of Rage 1 through 3. Yeah, so you were telling me in general, like, on most of the Streets of Rage games, it, it has to do with, like, a... Uh, like a mob boss taking over the city, and we're trying to take back the streets. Yep. In one of the Streets of Rage games, I believe you went all over the world, or you stayed mostly in Chinatown. Mm. So, I mean, each game had you doing different things. Yep. But the, you know, the point was the same. You still beat up people, and it was fun. <laughs> yeah. And people are asking me, who's my favorite character? My favorite character has always been Blaze. Blaze has appeared in every single game along with Axel, and her okay. moveset keeps getting better and better. I really like this character with the... Um, metal arms? Metal arms, he's really cool. Lloyd? Yeah, yeah. he's a newbie. Oops. Mm, it's cool that Cherry is the daughter of, um... Adam. Adam from, like, the original game. Yatta! Good job, Blaze. Oh yeah. And we'll also be looking at some of the additional characters, guys, because this is a very short game, unfortunately. Streets of Rage, the original games can be beat in about 45 minutes, something like that. Yeah. The replay value came from how fun the gameplay was and just beating up people, well, you know. You were just telling me when before we started this game, like, uh, today, this morning, like, how... Oh, I'll tell you later. It hurts, but it would hurt even more if it were to crash! The old pier. Why? Why you gotta be like that, girl? I thought something was wrong with my headphones. So I was listening for the. No, there's words, no voice acting. I forgot. This is old school. This is <laughs> you gotta read, yo. Oops. Yeah, and I'm assuming like when we're beating up law enforcement and stuff, I'm assuming they're completely corrupt because we're like. Well, the city's seen better yeah. days. Oh, that was awesome! You can like. We're trying to clean up the streets and, like... Well, you're vigilantes, so... Yeah, we're vigilantes and former uh, police officers. Basically, Correct. working together. Yep. But now we're all vigilantes, basically. So, Streets of Rage has had a, a varied history, and a bunch of fans in 2011 got together and they made the Streets of Rage remake, which usually Sega is very cool about people um, remaking their games like fan creations they're not like nintendo and they go crazy like giving people dmc like uh strike down notices yeah. and stuff like that but streets of rage remake was so good and so different than the original it had all the playable characters from streets of rage one through three it had a better story than the original streets of rage games and it had like so many unique features that actually have made it into Streets of Rage 4 since this is an oh, official wow. canon game. Oh, okay. But they did a strike down notice and got the game taken down. Oh, wow. Um, back shortly after it was released in, I think, 2012. Maybe because they did such a good job. They did <laughs> such a good job. So Streets of Rage 3 was kind of the death of the series. Um, a lot of people like to refer to it as... If you go by Star Wars, the Streets of Rage 2 is essentially Empire Strikes Back. It is so much better than A New Hope. Yeah. Like the, the first Streets of Rage game. And then Streets of Rage 3, people say, well, it's kind of like Return of the Jedi or The Phantom Menace. You know, it's it's there. It ended it. <laughs> it ended it, yeah. But it, it, it did some things that just didn't really work out well. Originally, the game was supposed to have, like, uh, a cool motorbike level, like, think, like, the sewer stuff in the Turtles beat em up games. So they were really going to go out for Streets of Rage 3, but they had cutbacks, and Sega was rushing the game to come out. So there was a lot of stuff that didn't make it into the game. But what's awesome about the fan game is all those great concepts that were supposed to appear in Streets of Rage 3, they put in Streets of Rage Remake. They also added a feature where... Uh, you could choose what route you would play and it would change the story. So oh, there was like wow. 32 stages. So why didn't... why did it end the series then if it was that... No, the remake? Oh, that was the remake. The remake oh, did that. No, the... Streets of Rage 3 was just... It, the stages were longer, the story was kind of meh, and uh... Okay. Know, the graphics weren't that great. Oops. That dude ran at you with a little bottle. Ooh, it wasn't yeah. very nice of him. 
And I actually did a review of the original uh, Streets of Rage with my uh, friend Total Biscuit, if you guys want to check it out. We talk a little bit about the history of Streets of Rage. And I believe we both say that Streets of Rage 2 was our favorite game. Unfortunately, we never got together to, uh, you need that health, to do the uh, second game. But if you guys really enjoy Streets of Rage 4, Amber and I can always play the original three games. Because hmm. we have them on the Switch. Ah, Estelle. eat bottle. Whoa, she looks pretty buff. Super! Everyone looks buff in this game. Yep, so to do your super, honey, hit X and A at the same time. Okay. You have what's known, see, as that star ability. There you go! Yes! Here we go! Sweet! Oh my gosh, they're calling in a police strike! This is old school! Watch out! Ow. Ah. That was a move that, uh... Axel or Adam would call in in the original Streets of Rage. Oh, wow. That was your super move. So now this lady is using This lady is a corrupt police officer, yeah. Okay. Estelle. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. Doing great. I just threw her. Gonna wreck her, Amber. Time to get wrecked. Booyah! Good job, Blaze. Uh oh, please strike again. Cleaning up the streets. Ouch! Man. Why you gotta be like that game? Come on. We don't have time for these yahoos around here. Boom. Oh yeah. Watch out. Good job. Thanks. Oh dang, that is pretty sweet. Whoa. Oh. Booyah! Uh oh. No! Ooh. My metal arms are amazing. Yeah, they are. Oops. Oh, Floyd Dude. died. Floyd. Floyd, no! Airstrike. Let's, let's stop that. I didn't even though. know that police could do that. I thought you had to be, like, in the... I mean, it's a whole... Oh, my gosh! Gang war type thing? Yeah, I guess it's, like, a huge, almost, like, military state, like, thing going on. Ooh. Oh my gosh. You got this. Nicely done, Amber. Yeah. I da -da 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 <laughs> Stage four clear. Nice. I like how Blaze does that with her hair. Girls used to do that all the time. Oh, yeah. Blaze. Yeah, to, to part their hair like that. Totally. Like run their fingers through it and like flip it. Mm hmm. You won't get away that easily. Listen, lady, can't you see the syndicate is behind all this? Shut it. You broke the law. It's my duty to put you in jail. Central requesting backup! We're surrounded! They won't let us get this time. Get ready! Oh, there's Adam! Hey, guys, long time no see. Well, Dad! What's up? And who might you be? Hmm. Stand down, officer. I'm with the Special Investigation Forces. Let them go. Uh, you don't have jurisdiction! It's kind of intense. Run along. Dad, I can't leave you! Don't worry, sweetheart. I'm back now. Right where I belong. Daddy's just gonna talk to the lady. Oh, yeah. Adam's back in the game. Literally. Adam! Adam, unlocked! unlocked. Oh, yes! He hasn't been playable since Streets of Rage 1! Whoa! Adam is back! Adam is back, yes. Sweet. That was pretty cool. I didn't think... You didn't think we would unlock him that soon, did you? Oh, I didn't know he was going to be unlocked as part of the story. He actually does save your life a couple times in the Streets of Rage original games, like as a story. Mm. Oh, don't stand in that. That's radioactive death. So is Adam always a vigilante or was No, he he's a cop. He oh, stayed he on a... the force, yeah. Oh. He's with Special Crimes Unit or something. Interesting. Yeah, yeah. Like, all three were best friends. Axel, Blaze, and Adam. Like, they were all cops in the first game. And then, you know, uh, Axel and I believe Blaze left the police force, and then Adam stayed on, and that's why Adam wasn't playable in oh. the other games. Oh. But Adam saves your life a couple times, like with a chopper. 
um, when things got too crazy. And wow. it was either Streets of Rage 3 or 2, but he's not playable. Wasn't playable in those. I don't want to be in the sewers with all this radioactive stuff. I might, you know, get a shell or something. And turn green. So he's try trying to fix the corrupt police force from inside, like Gordon was. I don't think the police are corrupt in this. I, I think that you just randomly beat them up because you were thrown in jail. Because oh, you're vigilantes. You're trying to get out of jail. You're vigilantes. Vigilantes. Well, why did that one lady say like something like? Well, that was a cop that we were fighting. Adam told oh. her to stand down. So. Oh, okay. I dang. see. Oh dang! Come on, stop that! I can't see where I'm going. Why are these guys just standing here with their hands in their pockets? I don't know, it's... 90s thing? Yeah. That's enough of that. Oh, yeah. I just remember a lot Oh, of sorry. Oh, it's okay. I remember a lot of people just standing around trying to look really cool. Oh my gosh, place. Amber, there's a reference. That's uh, Revenge of Shinobi. That's a oh. Sega game. Awesome. Reference. So Sega went and they actually redid the game themselves then? No. Um, this was made by an indie studio. Seg it's in association oh. with Sega. Oh, okay. So they got... They had Sega's backing to do it. They have Sega's permission to use the characters and stuff like that. That's cool. But uh, can I just go out on a limb and say... Um, indie company that made uh, the awesome Streets of Rage game. Can you do Golden Axe 4? <laughs> or Golden mm -hmm. Axe 5? I think it's time. I, I think people are ready for some beat em up goodness. Get the uh, chicken, sweetie. There you go. Sorry. We're actually getting chicken tonight, so. Oh my gosh, we found out that you guys should check and see if KFC delivers in your area. Yep. And if, if KFC is not in your area, I'm so sorry. But as you guys know, Luke is uh, basically really allergic to chicken. I got sides coming, so. Oh, Luke has the sides. And the biscuits. Uh, Luke has. Oh no! Well, we only got one biscuit! Oh no! Well, we could share the biscuit. Oh my gosh, Luke! It's okay, it's okay, I didn't know. I forgot! It's okay! If we like this, we'll do it again. It's not a problem. Oh, uh, one biscuit? I love the biscuits! I know. Now I'm depressed! Oh my gosh, I forgot to get more. Maybe we can call them. No, they're already on the way here, honey. They don't They do not do that. It's okay. Aww. Amber likes biscuits, too. Everybody loves the biscuits. It's okay. I forgot. It only I forgot came with too. One biscuit, you can have it. No. Yeah. I'm fine. I got my sides. The biscuits are actually pretty good. Like, I know, right? You get. I'm sorry, but sometimes you get the biscuits like from frozen biscuits, mm -hmm. and they have that weird like. They're made with like Crisco or something, and they just. Oh, there's another reference for you. This is what the uh, bikers look like in the original Streets of Rage. Oh, these people look crazy. They weren't girls, though, last time. They were weird biker guys, and they would, um... They kind of look like foot soldiers. Like, reskin foot soldiers. Man, everybody in this game is so buff. Yep. Also, uh, Capcom, uh, you can't let Sega show you up here. You gotta bring back Final Fight. Final Fight needs to come back in this style. <laughs> let's let's bring back beat em ups, yo! Beat em ups need to rise. I wonder what kind of beat em up someone would make health that would take place in the 2020s because I don't know, I just don't even I think you would get arrested for looking at someone wrong in this day and age. You couldn't really Yeah, but there's it. like mob things all the time now. It, yeah. It's like the the fictional world where all this mob violence existed. That's kind of what the world is like now. It, be yeah. it became Streets of Rage, kind of, sort of. Well, I mean, I'm sure there is a lot of violence that's illegal going on. Oh, of course. Oh my gosh, look at me smashing two Ooh. people above my head like that. So awesome. Oh yeah! Oh yeah. How do you like that? That feel good? Yeah, it does. Oh, puke! Uh, sorry, pool cable! Puke. Oh, you can get a pool stick. Pool stick! Whee! Oops. So you played as Blaze a lot? when? Yeah. When the, because she has really cool moves, you were saying? She has great moves, and she uses, like... I don't know, the Axel's moves I just didn't like. Like, she feels like she has better range and stuff like that. Like, her super moves are, like, more versatile. Like, Axel is... Mm, now I want to see... We saw Adam... Get, get the apple, sweetie. Adam's, uh... 
There's Adam, Adam's brother, Adam's daughter. Where's Adam? Whoa! Where's uh, Adam's wifey? Oh my gosh! We're oh. playing one of the original bosses. Whoa, we're like... I, I attacked the arcade. This is insane. This is what the game looked like. This was one of the bosses. Oh, really? Yeah. I guess Ooh. when you beat this guy, you unlock, uh, ow, one of the, uh, old school Streets of Rage characters? I'm, like, trying not to hit you at all. But I'm then I'm, fine. like... How much health does this fool got? Ow! I think that dude's supposed to be, like, the warrior or Andre oh, the Giant. is that what you looked like? Oh, no, no. No, this no. This is not what you... This is, this this is Streets of Rage 2, I believe. He's just a boss. Try to grab that health, honey. Oh. Oh, dang. I'll cover you as best I can. Oh. Oops. There you go. Stand clear. Booyah! <laughs> oh, yeah. So what do we get for doing that? I don't know. That was pretty awesome. That was fun. I feel weird picking up this bottle of, like, toxins or something. Well, I don't don't throw that at me, but there's a kangaroo. Kangaroo? Oh my gosh! Kangaroo was a playable character in one of the original games. Look at all the uh, fan service they have. Oh uh, Streets of Rage three. He was a boss character, and then he was unlockable. That's funny. Yeah, but Streets of Rage was so weird. It just wasn't as good as the other ones. Just being honest. <laughs> Barbon. Ow. Yeah, he's one of the original Streets of Rage guys, too. Get him, Amber! Well, that's my grab, is my axe button. Ooh. Okay, that's good to know that we have health up there. Nicely done. Thank you. I'll deal with these people. Like, if you want to keep going one-on-one -on -one with him. Uh, if you get in trouble, let me know. Kind of. Okay, go up. Switch. Go up and get the Fine. health. I'm gonna hurt this guy. See the chicken up? I'll try to get the chicken. I haven't had chicken in, like, probably almost a year and a half. I hope you enjoy it, sweetie. I haven't had it so long, because Luke's allergic to chicken, so it's like... I don't really eat it. Oh. Like... I'm actually worried that it'll touch like something. Oh, well, it'll be fine. I doubt it. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be okay. Oh, snap! I just got wrecked. Just got wrecked so hard. Yeah, you did get wrecked. How do you like that? That feel good? Nice job. I feel bad for beating him up, especially because I don't know why I am. Grab that star, sweetie, and then use your super on him. Oops. Face him and use your Oops. super. There. Yes! Very nice! <laughs> My super move is really cool. Ow. I think Floyd is kind of fun to play as because he's really strong. Yep. Oh, yes! Stage five clear. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Foop. Foop. <laughs> hair foop. Let me do that. I can do that with your hair. No, don't, foop. don't, don't flip my hair. <laughs> Thank you, though. Okay, so... Oh! Axel, what are you doing? They're gonna have a motorbike level?! Please, please have the motorbike level. Please? That'd be something we haven't seen. Awww! Oh, come on! Come on, game! Chinatown. Oh wait, I can switch my character anytime I want, right? Uh, you no, can do it at, at the. Times. This is the last stage we're playing, and then we're I gonna can do, do... It for next time. Yeah. I do like playing as Floyd a lot, though. Floyd is fun. I do want to try to do now that I know how to do super moves better. I do want to check out like uh, Cherry and Axel's oh. super moves. So I have a feeling you're gonna be playing Blaze the whole time. No, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna go back to Axel or. I'll try Cherry or something gonna, like that. Or Adam. I'm gonna switch it up. I just like playing as different people. Mainly. Wait, down. we can play as Adam now? Yeah. Like, anytime? Yeah. Yep. That's cool. 
Anyway, guys and gals, that's going to do it for this episode. I'm pretty sure this is a very short game, so we're going to barely have enough for a third episode. But um, oh, okay. there will be a live stream where I will be playing through the entire game and uh, playing through the different characters. So join us tomorrow as Adam and Cherry kick some butt as father and daughter in Chinatown. Don't forget to Yay. like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell to be notified when more Streets of Rage arrives. And remember, we will be looking at the pixelated characters as well once we figure out how to unlock them. So playing through with the classic 16-bit uh, characters from the 90s. Awesome. I know, it's going to be pretty awesome. All right. Woohoo! Special shout-outs to our members, including our Ultimates. You know who you are. You guys are amazing. And if you guys want to join the membership crew, all you have to do is click uh, right here, and you too can join the K-Wings family. Anyway, yeah. guys, have a great rest of the day. Stay tuned later today for more uh, Animal Crossing and, of course, Final Fantasy VII Remake and Trials of Mana. Till then, God bless and happy gaming. See ya!